What's up, everybody? Andrew Mahone here with Dariams today from Tricky Jim. If you haven't checked out my channels on YouTube and Twitch, make sure to do that. Twitch.tv slash Tricky Jim, where I stream competitive Pokemon content. We have got an exciting PSA graded return for you all today. And to be honest, I think there's some Misty cards in this box. So I'm pretty stoked about that. Misty is my favorite gym trainer, trim leader. I do have a bunch of Misty cards. These are going to be some exclusive promos from the Misty box. So that is pretty rad. If you're interested in graded cards yourself, make sure to check out the link in the description below, psacard.com. They do a most excellent job with, uh, with, with their PSA grade returns. Now, if you're wondering about uh, why is the box out of the box, it's because, I mean, it's a box, it came in a box, all right? So this, this is just what the box looks like. If you're used to a box, Looking different. This is just what the box looks like, guys. All right, we got the box here. We've got the cards there. And uh, voila. All right, we've also got some cool EX Era Hollow cards here that I am excited about. And uh, some other swag. So, I don't know. Let's see what we got. Our first one. Ooh, I forgot I sent these away. Yes, we've got that amazing Charizard GX from Detective Pikachu. Dude, look at that. Look at it. It's Charizard in HD. What's not to like about that? All right, excellent stuff. In a 10. Now I have to say, all right, kudos to you, Pokemon, because you, you did a great job printing these promos. Do you guys remember those horrible blister packs that used to exist and they would just damage every single uh, promo card that came out of them? No longer. Pokemon figured it out. And now we've got... Promo GX is coming in PSA 10. So excellent stuff there. Now I did check the population numbers on these. There are a lot. There are like 600. So all right, you're one of many Charizard GX. Not very special, but you're special to me. You're special to me, Charizard. We've got another one I created too, just to make sure. And we've got back-to-back 10s. -back Feels good to get a Charizard in a 10, even if it is a promo card that 600 other people have also gotten in 10s. But it's cool. You know what, HD Charizard, you've got a place in my heart, so I'm uh, I'm digging it. Up next, we have got the exclusive Starmie GX, only to be found in that Japanese Misty Collection box, not released not released in the United States from the like Misty Battle Deck or whatever. Super cool card. We've got it in a ten. Check that bad boy out. That thing is awesome. Love these cards. And Japanese cards are always just printed so clean. They're just always so clean and crispy. Very, very nice. Excellent stuff from the trainer battle deck. I believe we should have another one. Another one. DJ Starmie. All right. In a 10. That's right, dude. Japan knows how to print their cards. They just look absolutely stunning. Great stuff there. Starmin, you can see you got the little star you kind of decal there in the back, looking red. Awesome stuff. Back to back Starmie tens. And we should have some trainers here. The Misty, I think that's like Misty's Determination or something in an alternative artwork. Very cool. In a nine. Oh man. I sent away two of them though. So here's to hoping that maybe the next one will be a 10. Very cool artwork there on the Misty. Why did we get a 9? Why? Tell me why. I don't know. Anyways, looked very clean to me. Anyways, let's move on. We've got Uno Moss here. Back to back. Can we get a 9 or a 10? 10, 10, 10? It's, it's a 9. Oh, man. Hopefully this is not a sign of more things to come. I just opened these straight out of the Misty box. And we've got nines on both of those. Could have something to do with the centering. We actually see that they are very kind of high on the top. And yeah, you see, I bet you that has something to do with it. Check these both out, right? Okay. All right. I see you, PSA. I think I see what happened here. See, they're like a little high. The tops of them are very narrow. And then the bottom are pretty thick. So I think it's a centering issue on those two understandable, but they were the only two I had. I mean, I could crack another one. I do own another Misty box, but it's sealed. Not really trying to crack it. Let's see. All right. The Misty Hollow. This artwork only exists in this trainer battle deck. It's got the Starmie there from the 
Starmie GX right there. So awesome stuff in a 10. That's right. Amazing card here. Gotta love that artwork. Japanese exclusives as well. The holographic border on the edge of this card. Absolutely awesome as well. Very, very cool. And Misty sporting her new outfit. This is like the new thing, right? She's got like the white shirt and the jean shorts. It's a very, very cool artwork there. And we've got another one. Glad we were able to pull out of that whole nine situation. And we've got a 10 on this one as well. That's awesome. Such a sick artwork there on that. So much motion. Very, very cool. All right. We've got a few more cards to go. Electrode EX from Fire Red Leaf Green. One of my favorite Pokemon sets of all time. Electrode is Natalie's favorite Pokemon. So I got this graded for her because uh, I love EX series cards. Uh, Natalie loves Electrode. This is one of my favorite Electrodes for sure. So we've got this one graded for Natalie. Here's to hoping for a 10. And it is. Oh, that is that is awesome. I checked the population of this card. There's about 60 of them that exist in a 10, and this is one of those 60. These cards are just super, super collectible. Amazing, uh, amazing artworks on all of these old EXs. I think they're really good cards to start investing in, and uh, I think they will be the next wave of cards to really just uh, boost in value. So definitely a sweet card added to the collection there. That one's for Natalie. Beautiful stuff. We've got, appears to be two more here. Japanese Misty's Determination. Now I've got maybe a handful, six. Uh, six uh, Misty's Determination Full Arts in tens in my personal collection. I even have a couple signed by Rachel Lillis, the voice actress for Misty. This one. Funny story, I actually got this card as a free gift, well, I guess as a as a gift, you know, from uh, my tattoo artist, who does all of my, you know, Pokemon tattoos. So, this one is from my tattoo artist. He gave it to me, and I was like, hey, this this card's pretty slick. We're actually going to get it graded, see if I can get this one uh, in a 10, and sure enough, we did. Oh, that is just stunning. I am really stoked about that. This is the only Japanese Misty's Determination full art I own. And also, uh, so that was like my only shot. One for one. I only own this one. And it's also really expensive in Japanese. It's really a lot harder to get your hands on the Japanese uh, full arts than it is the English ones for some reason. I don't know. But uh, the Misty's Determination full art in Japanese is like, uh, you know, maybe like a $40 card, whereas... The English one is like less than 10 bucks. So really stoked on that. Most excellent in a 10. And then we've got this Venusaur from uh, my buddy DJ. All right. What's going to be Venusaur? I think these old uh, base set hollows, really good cards to get into right now. In an eight near mint conditions. DJ's favorite Pokemon right here. So got that one graded for my buddy DJ. And uh, really, really stoked about that. Most excellent. Venusaur, beautiful card. And uh, eight near mint. It's definitely going to be stoked about that. So that's it for this graded return. Thank you all for watching the video. We got some really neat hits off of that Misty uh, Trainer deck exclusives, as well as some Detective Pikachu swag there. If you want to check out PSA's grading services, make sure to check out the link in the description below, as well as my YouTube and Twitch channels, twitch.tv slash tricky gym, as well as tricky gym on YouTube. Y'all have a great day. Take it easy. Peace.